Okay, good morning. Thursday, 22nd of November. Today we're on the bikes again, as you can see. Going to a town called Batamban. It's actually the second largest uh, city in Cambodia. So that should be interesting. There's also some ancient ruins around it, so maybe we'll see some on the way. So be a mixture of main road to start with and then uh, countryside in the afternoon. And maybe seeing some ruins in the afternoon. So we'll see how it goes. Yes. But the first thing we have to do is do what? Go to the breakfast place. Yeah, we'll find a coffee shop. <laughs> <laughs> Good thing about Cambodia, they've got some modern coffee shops uh, sprouting up in different places and there's a few in this town here so you go from uh, one extreme to the other out in the countryside and then you come back into a very modern looking coffee shop so that's what we're going to do now okay let's go oh, nice morning here early morning here this up on this town is called this is one of these places here five star coffee and bakery makes it easy for western tourists sometimes we can still get some comforts like croissants and this kind of thing <laughs> oh, very modern looking coffee shop here in Cambodia you can get uh, green tea and it really is green tea today <laughs> and, uh, some kind of croissant looks okay James got cold green tea proper now we just uh, left Sisabon changing direction now actually going south today we've left the main highway 6 that we've been following that goes uh well, we followed it east to west across Cambodia and we're taking highway number five which is going south to take us to a town called Batambang so uh, yeah let's see what this is like now we're uh, heading a different direction take life easy here in Cambodia the scooters don't really go too fast we can cycle as fast as most of it and even overtake some of it this Highway 5 here, it's not as good as Highway 6, well not the cyclist anyway, there's no large uh, shoulder on the side of the road, it's a bit more narrow, but luckily it's only this morning we're cycling on this, yeah. this afternoon we should be at some nice country roads, looks like they're building a new road though, so maybe in a few years it will also be nice to cycle here as well. Okay, this is now the worst road we've cycled on in Southeast Asia. Bumpy and dusty, quite narrow, I think. Low. And because of the roadworks here, yeah, it's more narrow than normal. And luckily, we're soon finished with this. Get into the countryside. This is where we're having lunch today. Perfect. That was a nice lunch here. Um, lunch in these kind of places because this costs four dollars today. That's for rice or stir fried rice with chicken and a pot of tea and two bottles of water. That's uh, what you pay when you're away from the tourist places. So uh, get out into the the rural cities here and the prices fall. And now uh, this afternoon should be I think a better ride than this morning. We should be in the, the countryside heading towards Battenborg. So about 38 kilometers now through the countryside. So let's see what that's like. That should be good. There should be also some uh, temple ruins on the way. So maybe we can have uh, a few things to look at now. So let's see how it goes. Just leaving the main road behind. Thank goodness for that. And, uh, hopefully now in the countryside. More quieter roads, hopefully. At Highway 5 there, that was no enjoyment really. On this route here we should be seeing the real Cambodia, not the tourist Cambodia. We're going away from the tourist trail now. See 
already people smiling and waving. They're not used to seeing too many touring cyclists come this way, I don't think. Well, this is when the adventure cycle touring is at its best. You just find a, a very small track like this and you just cycle down it. They've probably never seen other people on touring bikes, but not very often anyway. See men fishing there with their nets and then diving in uh, afterwards into the water. It's just sit and watch and see what they're doing. It's amazing. That's something you otherwise see, you never know what you're going to discover just down the road. Yeah, what we're seeing this afternoon, this is real life Cambodia. It's amazing to see the way they're living here, the side of the fields and the small canal that's been cut as well. It's been incredible. Fishing is the way they earn a living or find their own food. Just arriving at some ruins here called Wat Panom Ek. Just be around the corner here. Let's uh, have a look. I right, just turn up here and have a drink of water first, and we'll go and have a look around. So here we have some, uh, well, this is a modern Buddhist pagoda. Just behind this, there's the ancient ruins of a ancient Hindu temple, Angkor temple. But, uh, they play some extremely loud music from the Tanoi there. Hello. 
Hello, yes. Morning. Well, there we have the modern Buddhist pagoda, and behind here's the ruins of the ancient Hindu temple. Here's a Batambang. This should be a really beautiful road that we've done the internet. Let's uh, see if that's true. Probably 11 kilometers to go now until we get to the, the city. Music on this road, a bit like Vietnam again. Now in uh, Batambang, oh, that was a nice road into here. Let me just see if we can find a hotel now. And, uh, yeah, and that's the end of cycling today, 81 kilometers. Now we just turned up here, the Royal Hotel, and pretty close to the centre here. The guy who works here is a cyclist as well, so he pulled us in from the street, so uh, it was easy. <laughs> and over here in uh, Batambang, we also actually have a pub street here, but it's not as lively as uh, in Siem Reap. But, uh, let's see if we can find something to eat here, have a quick walk around. Yeah, buildings like this. Oh, beautiful. Yeah, well, this is a nice place here. It's a French colonial building here. And the sun is just going down now. Oh, great food here for two hungry bikers for some curry and spring rolls and James got some noodles. <laughs> That's not bad after a day on the bike. So the pub street here is more quiet than the one in the city and Reap. Yeah. Nice town anyway, some nice places. Okay, well, that was the end of today. Was, uh, yeah, the ride this morning wasn't too nice on that road there. That wasn't a, a nice road for biking, but this afternoon made up for it. And we uh, got into some of the back roads there of Cambodia, heading towards Batan Bang here. So that gave us a chance just to see the way people are living here in this part of Cambodia. That was really interesting. See all the men fishing there and all the, uh, the small shacks at the side of the, the canal. So that was really good. But uh, yeah, now we're in Batambang, we're moving on tomorrow. Tomorrow will be our last day cycling in uh, Cambodia. So uh, it's about 90 kilometers tomorrow, then we should be in a town very, very close to the border, Thailand. So, okay, that's it for today. See you tomorrow.